sour grapes. Once upon a time, there was a big furry fox that lived with his fox family in the woods. It was the fox's job to hunt for food for his family. He would stroll through the jungle looking for food. Since it was summer and his fur was thick and furry, the fox used to feel very hot indeed. On one such occasion, he came to a vineyard that was full of ripe grapes. The fox was very surprised. I must not have come to this part of the woods before, he thought to himself. I would surely remember such a beautiful vineyard. The vines were beautiful and green. There were big juicy purple grapes hanging from them. The big bunches weighed the vines down. The fox looked at the grapes greedily. His mouth began to water at the sight of them. He was so tired and thirsty that he decided grapes were just the right thing for him. By hook or crook, I've got to have some of these grapes, he said. He stood up on his hind legs and tried jumping up to reach them. It was of no use as the vines were much too high for the fox to reach. The delicious-looking grapes were out of his reach. I know what I'll have to do, exclaimed the fox. I'll crouch down really low and then jump up with all my might. That ought to do the trick. So he crouched down and sprang up. But he missed the grapes by just a whisker and tumbled to the ground in dismay. Then the fox had another idea. He saw a stone on the ground near him, so he went and pushed it with all his might and finally managed to roll the big stone under the grape vines. Now I'll reach the grapes for sure, he said. He clambered onto the stone and stood up on his hind legs and began to jump up and down again. But the poor fellow still couldn't reach the bunch of grapes. He really wanted to eat some of the grapes, but he could not reach them at all. The fox was very, very upset, and he began to howl. All my hard work for nothing, all in vain. I shall never be able to reach those grapes. However, he decided that he would try to reach those delicious looking grapes just one more time. So from the stone that he was standing on, he crouched down and sprang up at the grapes. But he only ended up hurting himself as he took a nasty fall again. The poor fox got up and limped away into the distance. Since he hadn't succeeded in reaching the grapes, he consoled himself by saying, The grapes are probably sour anyway. He vowed never to go into that part of the woods again. <laughs>